not so happy now to have two sick chickens. Well, this one here, the brown one, she, she's been more acutely ill than the white one. She's been kind of retreating to the corners of the coop and the yard for a couple weeks. This one here just started to get shell symptoms of lethargy or whatever, just like maybe three days ago. She won't eat, she won't drink. She's still eating and drinking, but she, she won't eat and drink. I gave her a little bit of a nettle tea with um, rosemary and oregano leaf. Because uh, I believe that they both have marks. I told you before that I suspected that my other two chickens that died most recently had was a rooster and one of my, my old hens. It was, you know, it's the nature of the paralysis that concerned me. Well, the rooster died very suddenly. purple so I think that he may have he may have gotten um well the Merrick's probably got into his heart and caused him like uh congestion heart congestion and um just turning off the uh the lights um so anyway I think that they both have it also. I mean, I've been trying to medicate them with different things. I've given them turmeric. Um, that seemed to help a little bit for a little while. Um, I don't remember why I was doing that. Anyway, <laughs> so anyway, um, I don't know. I don't know if uh, the brown hen is gonna make it much longer. She seems very, very far gone and I don't know. It's very sad. I have four chickens left and two of them look like they're gonna be expiring soon and then the other two look okay but you know if you have max in your yard you basically have everybody's got it so it's only a matter of time. So I'm kind of upset about that, but um, life goes on, so what are you going to do?